Good morning. Such a privilege to spend some time with you. We're talking about biblical characters and today we are going to talk about John, writer of the Gospel of John, Revelation and also a few letters. And listen how he writes about himself in John 21 verse 20. Peter turned and saw the disciple whom Jesus loved. Following the one who also had leaned back on his breast at the supper and had said, Lord, who is it that is going to betray you? In the gospel, you find John is not, a, he's not talking as much as Peter, but very close to Jesus. He's also the one who knew someone at Caiaphas house and that at Jesus trial, he was the one that took Peter in. So even in Jesus' trial, he was there and he was closed. When Peter left, he was still there and he could write about what happened there. So somebody very close to Christ, not only part of the three of Jesus' inner circle, but probably the one closest to him. And he writes about this. He's also the one to whom Jesus entrusted his, trusted his mother at the cross and said, look after her. Uh, so, so Jesus had a special relationship with this man, John. If you read through the Gospel of John, he's also the one that writes the most about Jesus' most intimate moments with his disciples. The washing of the feet, the prayer of Jesus. So somebody that had a different view of Christ. Yet when Jesus speaks about him, he called him and his brother um, James, he called them Buanerges, that means sons of thunder. It's a little bit of a, a contradiction. It's not the one that spoke the most, such an intimate man. How can Jesus call him that? And maybe the point is just this. Love makes a louder noise than all the other things we do and say, especially in the eyes of Christ our Lord. Can I ask you, how passionate is our love for Christ? That would make the loudest noise in his eyes. I think if you read Revelation, you also see that love open our eyes to see things few people will ever see. Love. This was the most important character trait of this disciple. The one closest to Jesus. He loved him. He looked different. He talked different, he lived different, and he followed hard after Christ. May God bless you, and let's develop our love for him. God bless, and may you have an awesome day. Goodbye.